Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, round two underway. Uh, we are on the play, and we're going to be keeping. Both of us are keeping. So it looks like I got a slower hand this time around, but once again, I have all my fixins. Feels like a big turkey dinner with all these fixins. Is that is that a good joke? <laughs> I feel that that was that joke was terrible and in poor taste. Turk turkey dinner, it's a turkey dinner with all them fixins. Oh no, oh oh god, that's dead. Oh my god, I've never seen something more dead. Um, what's the right play here? That's dead. That's definitely happening. I feel like the street spasm's possibly better later on. It sucks that I gotta kill that now, but oh yeah, that's never been a, a more dead guild mage. It also sucks that uh, I probably am not playing this jailbreaker on turn four unless I get lucky. Don't play another one. All right, that's annoying. God, this is... This is interesting. I think I'm gonna street spasm that. Because it allows him to get ahead on mana. It allows me to do something with my mana. And... It allows me to play my promenade. Alright, so now we're gonna just hopefully be going to town. Are we Santa Claus? Don't be something good. Oh, boo, that's annoying. Alright, we can easily outclass that, so... I think we start by doing this. As long as he's not playing Resto Angel, I think we're fine. Imagine he busts out Resto Angel, I'd be like, wait, what? That's me doing a double take. Okay, now I really wish I had that Street Spasm. Looks like he's debating the double block. Nope, okay, that might mean Giant Growth. Or rootborn defenses. Play this. If we're racing, let's do this thing. We are definitely racing, it seems. And outside of him playing at Armada Worm here, I think we're okay on this race. His deck looks very strong. I mean, when your worst card is this, and that's not even a bad card. Smash my face. Question is... Is he able to do some shenanigans here? I think yes. But Rudeborn defenses isn't going to blow me out. Because in response, I'm going to kill this. hell is this? Oh no, that's dead. Or let's hope that's dead. Okay, that's dead. Take eight. Feels like he should be lower, but he's not. Okay.
I think I just want to go double jailbreaker here. goes to two. No, I think I'm okay with this. I think I'm okay with upgrading here to a jailbreaker. Jailbreakers don't play something insane. Oh, he's playing black. That's good to know. Yep, alright. So we were just all about the heavy hands there. Alright, being against that he's playing black, I think I might want to bring that in. Also, I might want to consider these, because flying against green white is usually pretty strong. Another thing to warrant possible inclusion is this scorpion so let's bring these in and a lot of our early guys are going to be outclassed like a lot even our splatter thugs are possibly outclassed drag mangler seems like it still has relevant um, applications Gotta cut two. Here and I think I'm gonna cut the dread mangler. I don't know if I want this. Is this just worse than pursuit? I think it's just worse. Let's do this. And let's add an Island. And let's hope the Island does not F us over. Alright, we slow it down a little bit. Um but we also I guess try to make our deck a little bit better for this matchup. That seems good. This if he plays uh we have a way to deal with his guild mage. Red gate. I would have preferred the green gate. But I will live with that. Man, he's gated up. He's like an old folk gated community. <laughs> God. <laughs> That's an awful joke as well. Who loves these awful jokes? Play a swamp. No, oh, play a swamp. Don't just splash the guild gate and then draw it. That's like zero cool. Uh, Alright, I can't do much about that. Probably the worst card in my deck. Maybe he's not even playing a swamp. I can kill this, and there's no way I'm doing that. This on this, I've learned in the past, is very frustrating. All right, he's got a five here, or two, two threes. It looks more like a five, which is why I killed this last time. Oh, geez, that's gonna be a problem. You know what else is a problem? The fact that I am not drawing anything relevant. Pursuit of flight, maybe trade. Look pretty sad at my opponent. Be like, hey, do you maybe you want to trade? I'll give him the option. I'm still racing four for three. See if he wants the two for one. Okay, two for ones himself or us, so to speak. See, I told you this is strong against them. He's got to have something. I'm totally okay with gate crashing and scavenging onto it. This guy scavenges a beast. Just play little dorky things, please. That I don't have to worry about. Let me know if you would have made that trade there. I mean, if I hang back, we've already seen one pump spell out of him. He also has Avenging Arrow, sure. Um, 
So, you know, we got some things. This is going to get an upgrade. Could have tried to stab wound it, but that wouldn't have helped. I have a feeling he's going to go Guild Mage Populate, and we're kind of pants down. There's not much we could do. We're drawing a Street Spasm is, is pretty live, but we need one more mana. All right, he's not just Phantom General, eh? That sucks. It's going to be hard for us to deal with. We're, we're a little bit behind, I'd say. We're at 20, but we're taking four turn. Street Spasm. Um, flood much, broskies. <clears throat> All right, well we're racing now. He's still got avenging arrow, but I don't think sitting back and taking these beats is where I want to be at. Rootborn defense is gonna blow me out. Not saying he has one, but it's possible. Five does not beat six, but seven beats five plus stamp wound. So uh, we'll see what happens. Hopefully no whammies on the Avenging Arrow or Pump Spell. That's never a good thing. I don't know why he does that. Okay, so he's got the Rootborn Defenses. So now we're at six, and we have one out, which is Street Spasm. Let's see if it earns its keep over Annihilating Fire. This is assuming that he doesn't have a pump spell that just kills me. Good to know that he has Rootborn Defenses, though. Take ten, go to six. One time. Do it. Do it like a boss. Oh god. Is there any outs to this? This is that was not a good substitution. Scavenge. Block one, take six. Nope, you got it. A little bit of a flood there. I don't think slowing us down was, was a bad thing. Reborn defenses is gonna be a problem. I didn't see anything for the battle horn. I don't think this was bad, but, you know, we kept the same amount of green last time. I think this is a good card against him. I'm going to leave this in. I'm not going to question that. This might not be great, seeing that he showed us both Rootborn defenses and, um, and a pump spell and an Avenging Arrow, but I think in a bind it does really well. Let's play. Would you like to keep this terrible hand? This is really like a five card hand. I will not mulligan this hand. I will be greedy and hope to rip. I had a good feeling about this hand, so let's see how my good feelings feel tonight. God, he's got this every game. Uh, that's where all the guild gates have gone. Alright, we need one more red source and we're in this game. Wow. Mirror, mirror from last time. Come on, do it. All right. Um, is it worth it? I think it's definitely worth it to play this now. It just opens us up to so much. Like Corpse Jack, this and this are all insane cards. Corpse Jack on his in his own right is insane. What is this? And our healer does not bother me. Okay, let's try to get lucky now. See where we're at. We just want to draw lands now. All lands. All lands is what we want to draw. And we can't get greedy and keep this. We also have to remember his Avenging Arrow. We also have to remember he's got Pump. So if he swings, he most likely has Pump. The 
hell does that do again? Not the eyes. Fortunately, I don't even want to do this. Giant Earth is going to be such a blowout if he has it. I don't want him to start making 1-1s. One if he has Giant Growth, I'm screwed. I have the all four hands. Oh, don't have Giant Growth, bro. Motherfucker. You know, it's like one time. I still think I swing and offer this trade. It's like one time, don't have Giant Growth. That's all I was asking for. Alright. 1-1 one, one and gains Intimidate. I think my hand's good enough where if he wants to trade... Yeah, he didn't. So... I think we're going to be in trouble. I am a little bit annoyed that I'm losing to this one Guildgate. I mean, maybe he has two, but he's splashing a ridiculous amount off of this. I need my fucking removal spells. I don't need stupid dorks in hand. Hello, songbirds. I do not care about. If he has another giant growth, I just wish him good game. There's not much I can do. Okay, is this a real. Whatever. I'm on tilt now. Sorry. He has all the pump spells. He has all of the pump spells. How is that a bad attack? Maybe I should have seen that. Very frustrating. I have to play Scorpion here. It's disgusting. Like now he gets to give things intimidate and bash me. I don't know. Sorry guys, I don't know how I pissed this one away. I mean he's got double double pump spell. And now he gets to make a bunch of one ones, which we actually hope happens. Okay. And a block and trade out. He might want to exchange this for some tokens, which we kind of hope he does. So if we hit Street Spasm, we're looking good. He might also just have Rootborn defenses again. Okay, so he gets three 1-1s. One -ones. As you can see, why I wanted to kill this immediately. Gate is good, but Gate's not going to do much. He's a little bit hampered by this. I guess I just play Jailbreaker here. I can't swing just yet. We are at 10, though. So I have a feeling he's got the other pump spell to just kill us. Of course, if my... Sorry for being bitter. I, I just, you know, I mean, I walked into this one. I didn't think he would have that. I guess I hold back there um, just to block it. But then I still lose a guy, but at least it's something. Our only out is really to play to... Uh, okay, so he's got it. He's 100% got it. So he blocks. He takes 10 exactly. Oh, reborn defenses. That's awesome. Maybe I should have. I should have blocked like this. Yep. I'm just playing like shit. Street spasm. God, I deserve to lose. I've drawn 
one piece of removal this game. Uh, sorry to be whining. I'm just very annoyed that now he's going to kill me. His deck's good. I think our deck is still better. I think he just had a better draw. Maybe I played it terribly. Let me know in the comments. You could flame me and be like, you're an idiot. You shouldn't have attacked with that. You should have waited with Augur Spray. You shouldn't have walked into that. That block was pathetic. This block was awful. This on this was terrible. It should have been this on this, this on this, and I'd still have this. And we'd still slightly be in this game. I mean, flyers are going to kill me. Street Spasm doesn't even kill his flyers now either. I don't see what he's waiting for. He just pretty much... Yeah, that block was atrocious. I should still have this in play. Can I Can I just cheat this back into play? Because then that gives us an actual shot at winning. Uh, maybe not. Maybe he's still got it anyway. He's got another Rootborn defenses. Alright, let's learn our lesson this turn. This time. At least we can learn our lesson. And Guild Mage, man. Some things are just not fair. I'll trade out there and I'll take four. And he's just gonna chorus of might me. It's pretty obvious. Yep. Or another rootborn defense. Yeah, alright. Now I think your deck's good if you have two rootborn defenses. Okay, yeah. Uh Wait, what the hell is that all about? Well, I can't beat all these tokens. I mean, we're still dead to the four. It's unfortunate I don't have anything here. If we blocked... We're still dead to these tokens. So, no matter what I do, maybe I should have taken this out, but I think he's particularly good. I could bash for ten here. But that's not going to do it. Good game, opponent. And you played well. The cards were with you. Maybe this was wrong. But I still think they have problems sideboarding, uh, playing against flyers. All right, well, I'm sorry about not winning. I can't win them all, uh, especially when I play terrible. So let me know your comments. As you can see, I'm a little bit grumpy, so to speak, with that match. So if you can make your comments a little bit kind, I'd appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Please check out the mtgnoob.com.